Hello and welcome. My name's Adam. This is the penultimate day. It's day nine of 10 in the free Breathe Better online course program workshop thing. If it's your first day here, please go back to day one, work all the way through to here. There's some important preceding information before we get to this point. Now, one thing I haven't mentioned yet is breathing and functional breath work, whatever you want to call it, at its core is all about state change. We're changing the state of our nervous system, of our thinking, of our awareness, of our body. We're working with biomechanics, biochemistry, this psychophysiological mind-body connection. There's a whole lot of stuff going on. The exercise I'm gonna share with you today comes from the Navy SEALs. And they don't do anything that doesn't work because everything's like tested under extreme circumstances. You may have heard of this one before, it's called box breathing. Box breathing. Like, I sometimes think of it as a square. I don't know why they called it box breathing, not square breathing. Maybe it's the alliteration of the two Bs. It's all pretty cool anyway. It's pretty simple. All you need to be able to do is count to four. Breathe in, two, three, four. Hold, two, three, four. Out, two, three, four. Hold, two, three, four. Of course, all three of your nose, but you already know that. How long do you do it for? As long as you want. Five minutes is really cool. I remember when I first started this one, I really struggled with the breathe out and hold with the out breath, but I hadn't practiced any of the nose holding, breath holding, walking, air hunger exercises that you've already done in the last eight days. So breathe in for four, hold for four, out for four, hold for four. That's your box. Now that's all you've got to do. Now we talked about cadence breathing earlier. Well, in this cycle, it's 16 seconds. So you're only getting four breaths. We're well, almost four breaths every minute. So it's really slowing things down. But what's really interesting is there's a sense that you become more alert and more focused with this breath, but also grounded and calm. So it's kind of balancing off your nervous system. You're not going into fight or flight, but you're not going into drowsy, crazy, sleepyville either rest and digest. So it keeps you on this nice balanced spot. You might want to try this maybe before you're going into a meeting, a situation where you need to be calm but you also need to perform. Maybe an exam, maybe a job interview, I don't know, maybe your first date. Who am I to say? In for four, hold for four, out for four, hold for four. The way I look at this one is if it works for the Navy SEALs and they do it before missions, when literally lives depend on it, then there's something in it that we, as civilians, can use for ourselves. So try it for yourself. Record what you find in your little book of breathing goodness. Remember to keep testing your bolt score. Every morning when you wake up, keep taping your mouth. Stay aware of your breathing. We've got one more day to go. Can you believe it? I'll see you tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Please share this with a friend if they'll get something from it. And if you haven't connected with me on socials, what's stopping you? See you tomorrow.